In March of 2020, six partner organizations announced Engage Women's Empowerment and Active Citizenship. I'm so thrilled to share that uh, due to the partnership between the CODI, the university, and the federal government, we're able to move forward and, and begin the next chapter of this, this institution. And uh, I'm so pleased to share uh, that the beginning of this next chapter uh, will kick off with the, uh, a contribution of the federal government of $9.8 million over the next five years to support this new Engage Women's Empowerment and, uh, I forgot the name, Active Citizenship Program. <laughs> As with many organizations around the world, the challenges of the COVID pandemic had an immense impact on their efforts within the project. However, the partner organizations in six countries across three continents persevered, continuing to work together to advance gender equality by meeting and learning online while working within their individual communities. There are a lot of similarities when it comes to the position and condition of women. We complement from each other. Three years later, the partners in India, Bangladesh, Ethiopia, Tanzania, Haiti and Canada have been able to travel to Addis Ababa, Ethiopia and Ahmedabad, India to organize, plan, share and learn. For TGNP, Engage Pro, uh, project is very unique because it is a consortium. We are implementing this project with other partners from other countries. The partners are bringing their own knowledges, their expertise in some type of knowledges. It creates uh, an opportunity for us to learn and to share our experiences with some very strong organizations that are the similar experience but then different contexts. Everyone is going through the same issues, challenges and everyone may be having a different approach of tackling those. So we need to learn from each other. Like having this ability to connect with other organizations that are champions in their area in, in, in some um, that are very important to Clay is, um, is a very valuable piece of assets for the project itself. The five international partner organizations are using their collective learnings to design and implement an initiative specific to their goals and contests. We are working with women who are gonna change the rules of the game. The five international partner organizations are using their collective learnings to design and implement an initiative specific to their goals and contexts. They are supported by the Cody Institute and Global Affairs Canada. The objective of this project is empowering women, make them active citizen, so that they can come in leadership position and do uh, works and jobs in their community to develop their community. So the learnings are extremely essential to improve our services to the women, to enhance the development of women. And for TGNP, we have learned a lot. Uh, it has helped us to strengthen our intervention on economic justice and empowerment. The clear action plans that we make under Engage program, plus the monitoring plan that we make, I think it helps us to be on, uh, on foot always. So Kodi is looking not only the community development, also looking at the organizational development. It's not only about only the community or beneficial people. They are looking at us also and taking time and effort to enhance our knowledge and skill and making a bridge, you know, so that we can share our knowledge to the, our partners, partner to us and getting on board, on one board of engagement. A travers les différents cours de CODI et également les différents échanges qu'on a eu avec les différents partenaires de Engage, donc ça a permis vraiment à notre équipe de renforcer leurs capacités sur ces différents sujets. This beautiful journey keeps on um, ongoing and we can um, not only help save us 2.5 million members, but members across globally. So. Yeah, 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 yeah.